You know you just shake it now. Eh? You're not the one doing it. Uh-huh. Leave I alone. Leave I alone. Enough is enough. Now one, two, get that sword. Three. Chop it off. Come out of her. I declare you free. In the name of Jesus. Leave her. Clap for Jesus, somebody. Sometimes when they fall, let them fall. Just hold their, hold their head so they don't break their head. But they have to fall sometimes. Let this thing come out. You are free in the name of Jesus. Your daughter is free. Your family is free. There will be peace in your home. We started a new video. So if you're here, share it. This is the last video for the day. Get up, lady. Wow. What happened to you? When you fell down, I didn't touch you. Yeah, I was just feeling my whole body was shivering. Uh-huh. How do you feel now? My legs were wobbling. Your legs were what? Wobbling. Wobbling? Wow. And now how do you feel? No, I'm okay. I'm fine. You, should, you were feeling some kind of peace. Peaceful. Yeah. And weak. So you never knew that there was something in you that needed to come up? I didn't. You don't know. Somebody clap for Jesus. Thank you. you are free. That demon has left. Thank you, Your daughter doesn't need that medicine anymore. Amen. It's a demon. Amen. And you are free. Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. Make sure you send testimony. Tomorrow when you come with her, you will testify to you. Thank you. Somebody clap for Jesus. You come. The one with that hand. Yes. Let them stand on this side. Yeah, give her a mic. What's that strange illness? Um, I had liver problems since 2000. Liver problems? Yes. Okay. Since 2004. 2004. Yes. And uh, I have this sweating problem with my, you sweat in your and hand. my feet continuously. Like your hand is wet like there's water on it. Yes. Um, but it's sweat. Yes. Always sweating. Always sweating. And that started when? Um, since I knew it. My mom is like this as well. Yes. Your mom is still alive? Yes, she's still So you hand. sweat on your hand and where? And my feet. Your feet? Yes. Like what like the, what I saw is this sweat? Yeah, yeah. Look at show her palms with really. me. It's wet. Yeah. Just like that. Just like that. Steadily. Yeah. And then you have liver problem right now. Yes. And then said um the reason why I came here. I have uh, moving snacks in my belly, in my head as I'm speaking, like Sometimes so I right now as you're talking to me, something is moving on your head. Yes. And your stomach. Yes. Plus the liver problem. Yes. Plus the sweating on your hand yes. and your leg. Yes. Try. Only you. Only me. All these things. Yes. Where are you from, sweetie? I'm, I'm from London, but I'm, I'm originally from Zimbabwe. Yesterday I missed my flight and I had to come today. But you're still here. You came later. Yes. You just came. Yes, yes. Because I missed my flight last night. Are you supposed to come yesterday? Yes. Do you watch the videos? I do. Okay. So you believe that you'll be free today? Yes. So right now, something heavy is moving your belly yes. and your head. Yes. Plus this sweat. Yes. You want it to dry up. Yes. And the liver. Yes. What's the like disease? Now, they, it's actually tying the liver from time to time. I can feel that I'm tied. Like if, when I'm driving, it's, I, it's very difficult. I can feel something is actually tying it. Tiny. Mm. Yeah. Come on, sorry. You'll be free today. Come closer. Can you see? Mm -hmm. Open your eyes. Open it again. Close it. Put your hand down. When it goes fire all over your body, don't say anything. Just take a deep breath. Fire from your head to your toe. Your spirit, it's time for you to leave her alone. Uh-huh. 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 Mm. It's time for you to go. Come on now. You cause liver problem, cause moving objects, cause moving object on the head, making her sweat anyhow. Is it not enough? You've done too much now. Remove everything you put in her. Fire, fire, fire. Remove all the sickness. Remove it all. She came from afar and God will heal her today. Come out of her! 
the name of Jesus, take all your snakes with you. Back to hell where you belong. Fire. Fire. When I finish praying for her, I want that. See, look at her belly is moving on. I want that thing in her stomach to stop moving. She says she feels tired in her liver. Release that. Release that thing. Quick, 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 quick. Even on her head. Remove the snake. Remove that thing. Her hand. Dry it up. Dry her feet. Next time I see her, no sweat from there. More fire. More. More. And I use you as a point of contact to free your family members. Fire. More. Come out of her. In the name of Jesus. Angels, make sure everything is gone. Make sure everything is gone. More fire. More. More. You will be free today. You will be free today. Fire. 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 He kata ya babas. He did it about ski da babas. On the count of three, you chop off the head of these demons. One. Two. Three. Come out of her. In the name of Jesus. I declare you free. No more movement in your head. No more movement in your belly. No more liver problem. Your hand, your feet dried up in Jesus' name. God wanted me to do that. Release your hand. Take a deep breath. What made you scream like that? You don't know. How do you feel? Too much pressure. But how do you feel now? Um, she said, I feel easy. Somebody clap for Jesus. Check your movements. The movement on your head. On your leg. Your belly. I can't feel anything. She said, I can't feel anything. On my head. On my tummy. You know. Like, I don't know. In my head, I still. Your head, you still feel the movement. I have declared you free, so you are free. Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. When I say free, angel, make sure it goes. Amen. It is well. And tomorrow when you come, you will show me your hand. There will be no sweat in it. I poured what I need, so I don't know. Dry it up. And you say you are not the one that scream, right? And you say once in a while you feel something tight there. You don't feel it now. Okay. You will check your safety tomorrow. When you come, we'll give you the mic to tell us how you feel. Thank you. You are free. Thank you. In Jesus', Jesus name. Amen. Hallelujah. You are you standing? Yes, come. Somebody clap for Jesus. Give her the mic. You were among the people that came yesterday to welcome me now in the airport. Come stand on this side. So the camera lady can see. Uh huh. What is this strange illness? Speak loud and sweet. Before I used to be very prayerful. I wake up in the midnight. I pray. I join you online. And uh, when you said we should pray, when you said we should bring out water for prayer, we pray to it. I give my son to be yawning, spitting, you know, like. Uh, Try to focus on them when they are talking. We be they say they are not him and Sometimes we tell mommy, I'm scared of belly. I can't, I can't even look at her. She's, the power of God is too. Is your, too your son? My son is coming tomorrow. By God's okay, just tell me what the problem is. I don't want too much talk. It's and, draining me. Sorry. And uh, uh, as I'm praying always, one time I was praying and I didn't know in the room, my husband said somebody like a woman being came out of his body and he screamed. And as he screamed, he was calling me, calling me, like inside the dream I came. And the, the fellow, like, Utanka, mark part of my body, you know, the, the person has a uh, man face with a woman shape and everything. And since then, I started feeling something drilling at the back of my, my back. Something? What? Really, like something is like what something is flowing at my back and which side of your back? This side. Over there. And you feel it right now? No. And later on, I started feeling. So it. when do you feel it now? No, I'm not feeling. I'm telling you what happened when I went to hospital. I just I want the straight thing. Yeah, it's been said, almost five minutes. Yeah, they said I had uh, diabetes. Okay, so you are here for diabetes. 
Are you guys hearing what this woman sent me? I said, I need a strange illness. Came here, told me dream, everything. Only diabetes. That's, strange because, uh, it's not normal. That's not a normal thing that I asked for. I asked for something extraordinary. Do you, are you sure you watch me? Yes, I When you watch me, when I say I need a strange illness, diabetes is not a strange illness. Next time, go straight to the point. You guys have a way of draining me. You are healed in Jesus' name. I go. Next person, come. Yeah. Please, I don't need too much story so that I can live here. Tell me what the problem is. What is the sickness? Cancer in your womb. Yes. Straight to the point. Good. They Come on now. Uh -huh. It's not your cancer. No, it's cancer. They remove the cancer from my womb. They, okay, they took, take my womb out and they take my stitches out. And the cancer went to my over They took it out. And then after I have the, uh, the radiation, everything, chemo, and then the cancer went to my lab. And then part of my lab was taken out. So now the cancer is still in your body somewhere. So now, when they operate me in my, in my lung, I used to feel pain. The pain was so much. And then one side of my, my body is just, I don't feel like my body. On so side. this side? Yeah, this side. It's numb. It's numb. And in my head, I used to feel like there's something inside my head. I feel like something like swelling. Right now, there's, there's something yeah. there. Yeah, like swelling in my head. And my but the cancer stay in your body or it's gone? The cancer, I went, okay, they say the cancer is gone. Okay. But, but head, now you feel that left side? Yes. And, and your head feels somehow? And also my ears, I used to feel the noise all the time, noise coming from my ears. You hear it now? Is there a noise now? Yes, coming from here. All what does time. it sound like? And the headache all the time. It's a tree, all the time like that. In your ear? Yes. And then you say a headache? The headache is constantly. Right now you have it? Yes. I have okay. it when the pain is one side. So you have pain on this side of your body? Yes. yes. Like right now? Come into my body, yes. So what can you not do? Your hand, are you able to raise it up? This hand is really, it's not strong. I can't even drive very far. That's this one. hand is okay. Raise yeah. up. This one, this one you can't raise up. This hand is really... It's hurting you. It's pinning you. Yeah. And that was during the cancer period. Yeah. And they... In my ear. They're singing music in your ear. Um, Headache all the time. The headache is just. Yeah, come on, sweetie. There's too many things. No, it's okay. You want to be healed now, right? Come on, sweetie. And you believe? Just put your hand down. Relax. And you watch the videos or no? You watch for two years. Yes. Wow. And the water has not helped you. The prayer has not helped. Oh, one day I just um, you you say okay if you want to heal, take the water out and then. You bless the water. I think you should stand up. After yeah. when you bless the water, I start taking that water. And in the morning, I just went, I release all. Because when I eat something small, I used to feel my tomb is just full all the time. The digestion is not taking place properly. Since that time, I used to go to the toilet properly. Okay. So the water has helped you. You had yes. testimonies. Yeah. I like when people tell the truth. God bless you. Amen. You believe that after the prayer, everything will go. You will be light and yes. free. Okay. Come yes. on, Sweeney. Open your eyes. What's happening to you as I sprinkle the water? Hmm? Your heart is beating. So the moment I sprinkle water, your heart started beating. Yeah, close your eyes. Holy Ghost fire all over your body. Uh huh. Uh huh. You demon. When they want to fall in, just try to hold their head, but let them fall. Make sure their head doesn't hit the ground. You that is causing all this pain, she can't lift up her hand. I hear heal, heal, headache. Everything in this woman. Out of her. The name of Jesus. Leave her alone. Come out. Fire all over your body. Fire. Fire on this hand. When I finish praying for you, you will lift up this hand. Fire in your ears. When I finish praying, you will not hear that noise again. Fire on your head. No more headache. And fire all over your body. Every cancer remaining, hiding somewhere, melt away. Fire, 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 fire. Leave her. Out! In the name of Jesus. Come out. Leave her. Fire! You demon. 
It's time for you to go. You will leave her alone. Remove everything you have put in her. Take all your property. Rakatos, keep running her. Raise Katona, bring her for me. Raskete nebo skapayaha. She will be healed today. Her hand will be healed. I, that headache will go. The ear, she will not hear nothing. And cancer will leave her for good. Ah, you're already feeling relieved. I'm not done. Come. This woman cannot wait to come. Relax. Take a deep breath. Whenever you fall like that, something jumps up. Close your eyes. Thank you, Jesus. Holy Ghost fire one more time. Through her body. One more time. One more time. I need healing in this ear. Healing in this ear. I'm fire. That's her daughter. You say what? Mama, why? Fire. Wait, I'm not done. What is happening to you? Don't say anything. Stay here. What did she say, Mama? Why? Bring her out. Is no? Ah, this one, Mama, I'm picking up. Mama, I said that. You said what? She said she suffered. So what has that one got to do with it? Why, 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 Papa, Papa? Why Papa is holding you? Papa is holding me in the grave. 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 It is well. Relax first. Relax. Relax. Do you know what she's talking about? Say, Papa is holding you. What did you do? What did you do, Mama? My father died when she was six months young. And what so, did she say you did? Why did she say what did you do? Nothing. I, I, I did nothing. Okay. Just the, the father was sick with diabetes, and then I been looking after the father. And the world came to just watch the play as we went. We ran differently. So I'm the one who raised them. Okay. You know, as a woman, you can't stay alone when you are young. I have two children by then, then I have two. By force, and then I had to get another man. That's the gun point. You have to take that person then. So, so is that why she's crying now? Yeah, that's I right. suffered, woman of God. I was handed everything last as a child. She said she I was what? I had everything I want. I worked so hard for myself. Life has turned me down. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. You say, wait, it's, go ahead. You say, when you were what? Yeah, when I was six, it's one. After me, and she's the one looking after the sick lady. She, yeah, she's the okay. That's so she's been, she's right. been, her life, she's been taking care of you. And yes, I've been the, through, throughout. I've been in the hospital, so she's the one looking after children and go to school, this and that, everything. So she didn't That's go to school. She used to go to school in the morning, then come and cook for the children, everything. She did okay. So I she's been through a lot yeah. because of you. Yeah, it is well. Don't worry, it is well. We'll pray for her too. Open your eyes. I'm not done with you now. Calm down. So they are so quick to leave, Mama. Mama, why? <laughs> Somebody say, Pamela, why? <laughs> Mama, why? Why are you in a hurry to leave? Close your eyes now. Close your eyes. Let me go fire one more time. Check this body. Make sure nothing is left. Out of her! The name of Jesus. I declare you healed from your head to your toe. Pain gone. Everything gone. You are free in Jesus' name. Now raise up that hand for me. Are you guys seeing? Look at she, 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 Mama, you're dancing. Wait, give her a mic. She said, oh my God, I'm dancing. You know when you first fell There's and came no up, the hand was gone. The pain was gone already. The pain was gone because all the time I used to feel that pain. I, can't I think this is a bad spot. Come here. They are facing this. Uh, um, yeah. The camera lady is struggling. Can you stand up here, maybe, it's and raise it up? I'm very you high. can bend your. Bend. If it's high, you bend the phone down. So before you couldn't raise your hand. Just now you could yes. not. Now this, the pain has gone completely. Completely. Yeah, no pain. What of the headache? 
headache, It's still there. No. It's gone. gone. What of your ear? The noise. No. Nothing. You're not hearing anything. No, I'm okay. Are you serious? Yes. So when you fell down that time and got up, everything was gone. Nothing. I'm not feeling pain. So you feel different. I'm not feeling pain. Before I feel pain here. You feel pain all over. So your body is like brand new right now. Can somebody clap for Jesus? You are here. Wow. Mama is looking like a young girl. Mama can even run and jump. <laughs> Hallelujah. Come, let me pray for your daughter. Come, sweetie. My son is here. Go and see that you're free. You can see. So you, what happened when you saw her fall? You just started thinking of your life. No, or something in you was speaking. Yeah, it wasn't myself. It wasn't you that spoke, Mama, why? Are you serious? Are you kidding? Are you guys hearing? She said, what's it how? It just feels light now. You feel light now? Yeah. So when it didn't remove from you, remove from her, it left you too. I think so, because I'm so close to my mom, so and all the time when she's nowhere, I like, pray with her. So, face okay. here a little bit. <laughs> Let's her face like this. So because you are so close to her, the moment she fell, something manifested in you. Yeah. And now you feel like... Yeah, because I had this pain in my back. But if I go to the hospital... There they is don't see it. But I, now is the pain still there? No, no, it's, there is no pain. Are you guys hearing? And if I go... Hey! Like, what demon controlling two of them? Like sometimes if I let out wind... If I fight in the house, you can't stay. It's like a rotten egg. When you when you mess, yeah. I can't no, stay. No. Please don't mess in this hole. No, no. <laughs> it's, it's like rotten egg. Because like, the same problem my mom has like for the stomach is what I had. I can't digest food. But the moment mama got healed of her pain, the pain in the back yeah, is gone. gone. So you mean when you were saying mama why it wasn't you? No. I love my mom. I mean, somebody clap for Jesus. Are you guys seeing how this same woman change? Come, sweetie. Open your eyes. Let's just check you out here. Yeah? What's happening to you? You feel wavy. We just need to check you out. When I say you are free, then you are free. Hey, 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 hey. Hey. What's happening to you? Her grandmom gave her away. Grandma! This is how I'm suffering with my mom. God punish you! Please, don't punish you. Who, who got punished? Oh, eh? Grandma. Grandma. Uh, Papa, you will not live this year. You will not live to see this year. You will not see me. You are threatening Grandma. No, 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 no. Who is this demon? Open your eye again. Open your eye again. What have you done to this man? Our sister is suffering the same in Africa. They've closed all the door for us. They've taken everything that my father wants for. You see, she's not the one saying. Are you the one speaking now? This again? Is something speaking you? Hmm? Is it you that is saying this? Ah, uh, Sibana, Sibana, leave me alone. What does Sibana mean? I should leave you alone. Eh? Who is Auntie Bana? Tibana means leave me alone. Tibana means leave me alone. I should leave you alone. I cannot leave you alone. I want to go back to Kenji Kenji. I don't want to stay here anymore. Uh, I want to go. Wait, I just pray for her mother and her mother is free. Do you like that? No. Uh, no, we hated that woman. We never liked her father, the father to marry her. We wanted someone from our own tribe, but she still came into the family. Mm. So we who are you waiting, now? We are waiting for this daughter to come to Africa. We will kill all of them. Mm. Who are you? I'm the grandmother. I'm still alive. Mm. Yes. Is this the father's mother or the mother's mother? The, the father's mother. So the grandmother is here a witch? Are you a witch? <laughs> are you a witch? Grandmother, are you a witch? I've eaten 
so many children. Mm. And I'm still living up today. How many years are you now? I'm nearly 90 years. So you eat children to stay young? Yes. How many have you eaten? I've eaten my own granddaughter. She would have had child this year. I've eaten I've the child. Oh, really? So when they have, they get pregnant, you eat the child? Yes. This my sister had three miscarriages. One in the womb, she nearly died. So she had an they... accident as well. Who caused it? It's me. Mm. I'm still alive. Do people know you are a witch? Yes, I'm in the camp. You're in the camp? Yes. So what will happen to you when I kick you out of this body? I don't know. Maybe I'll go back where I came from. Okay, I want, to, I want you to die. To confess and die. So I'm sending an angel there. They will break Don't your kill leg. my grandma, Salome, please. Don't oh. kill her. Oh, this, this one is begging for the grandma. I don't understand, though. Which one is speaking now? Is this a grandmother or that one? She had 13 children and now only five living. So who only killed the five. other ones? She ate all of them. Hey. So you, did she, did she initiate you? She didn't like me because I was born a girl. She wanted a boy. Did she, did she put you in anything? She told my mom, this is a girl again. Mm. Mm. So she wanted to put you in a witchcraft. Are you part of them? No. No, you are not? My Jesus lives within me. That's why I'm still alive. Okay, so you are the one speaking now. I want the grandma to be back again. Grandma, what else have you done? I've taken all my sons. All your sons? I have left only three sons. So you killed this girl's father? Yes. How did you kill him? Some woman came into the office and put stuff on the table and the stuff went into her eyes, to his eyes. And we blamed it on his mother and we were waiting for her. You blamed it on the grandma? We blamed it on Angela. The on the wife? Yes. Mm. Now but we're all looking for her, calling to hear her voice so we can take her voice. So when, when witches call people, they just want to hear their voice. And what do they use the voice for? That voice means a lot. So what can they use the voice for? We can call you in the night. Oh. Then you can wake up. When they call the voice? Yes. You will wake up. It's the same thing we're doing to the daughter. She'll wake up in the night. She doesn't know she's standing at the window. Mm. By the time she realizes she's too cold, then she can go back to bed. But this girl here, Sarah, saved her life. Every single day, watch Belema, watch Belema, watch Belema. She even told her to go to this prophet in, in Kampala, Prophet Kakande. She went. And now she's living the life. She goes to church before she does it. So why don't you like Belema? What happened? Oh, that three minutes of video chai. <laughs> <laughs> the three minutes video, what happened to it? Every time you drink that water, it cleans something out of you. Yeah. It does? It does. Yeah. So people, people should believe that that water is very powerful. Eh? See, Mama, every single day coming to my house, Sarah, Sarah, where are you? Sarah, Sarah, where are you? She knows the water lies beside my bed. Anytime I wake up, I drink. She comes in, she drinks, she calls it, you and your princess, 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 princess. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Let me ask you. I want the grandmother back. So if, when you guys call people and they don't answer... Are you able to get their voice? Oh, yes. How? In the spirit. In the spirit? Yes. So, is that why when witches call people, they pick and they just hang up? They don't say anything? Yes. They, they did not need them to, they just wanted to hear their voice? Yes, that's all. How about when they send text message and you, you oh. reply? See her phone. She has messages. She doesn't even know who is texting her. So, it's you that is texting her? Ah. Uh -huh. mm. Not your daughter. You just be sending messages. We have agents, so hey, yes. agents everywhere. Hey, the, <laughs> the sister's husband is one of them. Who? I I said I'm gonna kill them. Which I person? Was, which person's husband is one of them? My sister's uh, husband. Is one of them. Is one of them. That's one of your agents. Hey, that man, he's a king down there underneath the sea. Hey. He was like, this year I'm going to drink all, the, all of their blood and I'm going to be rich. Mm. Mm. So how many blood has he drank so far? Oh Jesus, he tried to sacrifice my sister. Mm. Mm. Okay, so this is you now. I want the grandmother back. Grandma. Grandma, Grandma come back. Grandma Salome. Ooh. Grandma that Salome. She's a big witch. Big Grandma witch. Salome, come back. She's a big witch. Alright, angel. 
Grandma Salome, wherever you are. She's when punishing I kiss her daughter in America as well. Oh. Sickness, 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 sickness. Agnes is always sick. She doesn't know why she's sick. Her son died. She doesn't know. They ate the child. It is well. Yes. So now, I will free this lady. And grandma will confess and die. Yes. And all the witches in the family. They will confess and die. Yes. The king of the sea or the queen of the... Whatever they are king or queen. They will all confess and die. On the count of three. Grandma set your head ready. To be chopped off. One. Two. Three. Chop off that head. Out. Be free. In the name of Jesus. Clap for Jesus. Clap for Jesus. You said so many things. Did you know what you were saying? What? No. Are ah, you were saying things so? Ah, your grandma is a witch and everything. Ah, that poor woman. I used to send her even money for hospital. How do they always? They call you at night and you get up at night. They're looking for who to call you. You say Jesus. You did not know saying that. You see too many things here. Because I know she used to get sick and... Your grandma is always sick. Yeah. And then I would send her money through my cousin. You always send your grandma money? Yeah. Does I, your mother know you're sending money home? I used to. So you really love your grandma? I've never seen them. Okay. So they were... Did you, did you hear what she was saying? Don't worry, sweetie. You're already free. You too, you are free. Amen. I have said your grandma will... She will die. Amen. Because he says she's eating a lot of children in the womb. The people be having miscarriage in your family. Go punish her. <laughs> <laughs> but you, it came out from your mouth now. But it is well. You are free. And this is the brother. The sister that the husband is the agent. So this is your brother. And yeah, come, let us check you out. You say God punish the grandma. Give, give the mic, give the mic. This boy is my son. Follow this lady. Face, face this way so that my, Follow this one. my audience can see your face. But he is a boy, he's a quiet boy. He can't look for a problem. But the problem is, is it's like women, like girls too much. And she likes drinking. <laughs> he likes he like drinking. He likes smoking. All the, the girls, the girls who they are friends with, lead them, lead her to everything like that. So now, you don't think it's normal, right? Now it's not normal. Okay. So you, okay, that's fine. Let's just yes, free. Now she left the house. Let me talk. Let me talk. She left the house. She go to the lady's house. In our culture, it's not necessary. Okay. You leave your mother's house and go to go and live with a woman. It's yeah, not a good thing. You have to take care of the of woman, the woman first. Yeah. That's right. All right. I need her, I need him to so right now he's living in a woman's house. I need him to leave the woman and go and to come. school. Finish the history university. That's what I need. Yeah, come on, come on, come on, come on. How old is he? You're thirty. Twenty eight. Twenty eight now. Ah, he's an adult now. You didn't finish school. Do you wait? Do you do you believe that you need me to pray for you now? Yeah, I need the prayers, like you know. So I'll, I'll be going back to finish, like, finish up my course, like you know. So I'll, is there something making you not to finish school? You're not interested in school. Oh, I'm interested in school, but something stopped me. I don't know why. Something. Something like, stopped you. Yeah. How about women? Do you just like women like that? No. Not really. Like they just you know something stopped me as well. Like something pushes you. Just drugs me, like. And, but you don't like it, but you just find yourself doing it. Is there anything else you do? She said you smoke, you drink. Do you like doing that? Those no, things? I don't, I don't like drinking. But you find yourself drinking. Yeah. You, you don't like smoking, but you find yourself. You want to stop, but you can't. I want to stop. I want to stop. But so after I pray for you now, she says she wants you to go back and finish. You will go back and finish. Yeah, will. And you will leave the woman's house. Where do you want him to stay? Come back to you. Okay. So you wanted to live with you, and not a woman. They want me to come back to live with 
them that you know because I left the house like a few months. So okay. I, I you don't like living with them? No, I like living with them, but I think I was just I was just drug addict. Just drug addict. You were a drug addict? No, I was just drugged to leave them with them probably. You were dragged yeah. by something. I was just really too soft to so accept to live with them. Okay. But well, do you miss living with them? Yeah, I do, I do miss living. So after the deliverance you go back home? Yeah. All right, somebody go for Jesus. Welcome. How do you feel right now as you're standing in front of me? Are you feeling like shaky or something? Give him the mic. I feel light and my heart is packed so fast. Okay, you can't be feeling light. We have not removed things. Your heart is just pounding fast. That demon is about to leave. Come close. Just put your release your hand. Take a deep breath. Open your eyes. Open it again. Open it again. Fire. One more time. Close your eyes. Close your mouth. Release your hand. Holy Ghost, fire all over your body. Fire from your head to your toe. You demon tormenting this young man. Uh huh. Uh huh. Fire. Fire. Look at that. It's time for you to leave him. Fire. Fire. Come out of him. Leave him alone. Come out. The name of Jesus. Take all your property. You are making him smoke. Making him drink. Making him sleep around. Enough is enough. Making him not to concentrate in school. Angels. Pockets of fire on him. I want total cleansing. I want him to be free. When he comes back tomorrow. He will testify. That he feels different. He doesn't want to smoke. He doesn't want to drink anymore. He's not attracted to women like that again. Out of him in the name of Jesus. Come out. Don't say anything. Fire. More fire. More. What is happening to you? What? Something's pulling you back. Yeah, something's pulling you back. Pulling you back. Don't fight it. More fire. You demon. Now, angel, on the count of three, you chop off the head of these demons. One, two, three. In the name of Jesus, be free in Jesus' name. No more smoking, no more drinking, no more womanizing. Your memory is restored. You will do well in school. You will finish. You will be successful. You will fulfill your destiny in the name of Jesus. Come, come close to me. How do you feel now, sweetie? I feel so light. I feel relieved. Like, so. How is your heart pounding? It's still falling fast. It's coming down. You are free. Somebody clap for Jesus. Do you know what was happening to you when I was praying? Mike. Pulling you back. Back. It's the spirit. Now you are free. You will see women. And you will run. You will see cigarettes. It will stink in your nose. Drinking no more. You will go back home. You will finish school. What's happening to you? Eh? What was happening to you just now? Tell me. You still feel the power. Yeah, the power is still So I feel right. And as well, you are free. Yeah, another thing I want to tell you, like, I was playing soccer, like, it was the last, last June, like, you know, it was a tournament. I broke, like, the players, the, like, the tournament, African tournament. So, you like, broke your leg? Yeah, they, I got, like, stuck on me, so I broke my leg, so, like, my leg, like, I, like, I love playing soccer, but some, sometimes, sometimes I play soccer, I feel pain. Which leg did you break? The right leg. How is it? Is it hurting you now? Feel it? It's not hurting me. So, was it hurting you before? Before, yeah, before it's hurting me. After this prayer, check it now. I mean, like, is it paining you? Do you feel pain? No, it's not, it's not painful. It's not pain. So what's wrong with it? I, I was just saying before, like... Okay, but you are fine now. Yeah, now I'm fine. Now. You are free. Clap for him. Clap for Jesus. Go ahead and sit down. This woman in the blue, come on. What's wrong with your child? Give, give the mic down. You said the problem started. Go ahead. 
in the hospital when um, they gave me injection to bring her out, the doctors were there. But no doctor, the very doctor assigned to bring her out because I had the two other boys, two cesarean, so she was booked for a cesarean. And uh, they didn't bring her out almost two hours in the womb while they had been giving me an uh, mm -hmm. anesthesia. Yeah, so that's how she went. Uh, how old is she? She's uh, almost 14. She'll be 14 next month. She's 14. And she's yeah. been like this since she was born. Look at her when she was four. So she was, as, as she's growing, she's changing. She's changing. Yeah. So she was actually yeah. normal and everything. She's a healthy baby. Yeah. So when they dissolved that, after four years old? No, from the theater. From the theater, but she keeps. So she's getting like how older or what? She's old, getting older. Here is 2009. But when now it's 10 years ago. Yeah. And her neck is going up. Not only her, everything, both her bone, everything was... What, did, what condition did they call it in the hospital? Because they don't want to accept uh, the thing. They, up to now, they haven't told us what uh, exactly happened. It's wrong with her. Yeah, but in the theater, I was screaming. After almost two hours, I was sweating because... They're, they're, they're supposed, when they give me injection, five minutes, they'll bring her up. But two hours, when I asked the theater nurse, they said she, the doctor assigned for that was in another hospital in a theater. So why did they give you the injection? They were not ready. They are not ready. My husband was there with me too, and the specialist nurse was there. After some time, my husband left. So you didn't sue them? We are still going through it, but I don't need to know about it. And I have hired three lawyers. They will go and pay the lawyers. I'm looking for another lawyer now. I have finished. Oh, for 14 years you've been fighting them. Have you yes, 13? Yes. She's 14? She will be 14 on the June. So she's first. still 13? She will be, four, yeah, she's 13, but she will be 14. No, June I know what I'm asking. Yeah. yeah. Right now she's 13. Yes. Yeah. There's something about 13 today. <laughs> Are you guys getting what I'm saying? Yeah. The number 13 keeps popping up. Yes. This is so strange. Wound. Uh, before I was in the hospital for five days, begging them, her two gum was done together. Wow. She can't, uh, the whole bone. But before you had the baby, when you did the scan, everything was everything normal. Everything was normal. I showed Brother Darlington here because we. Who is Brother Darlington? Who is it? You? Yeah. Okay, so you are family friends. We are in the same church. I have shown her some of, shown him some of the medical records. Okay. It is well. yeah. Let me pray. Bring that close. So this girl is 13 years old now. Yeah. This beautiful girl. Um, last month, uh, two months ago, she has a hole in on, the, on the head. Mm. So she went to school, came back. When I was bathing her, because I watch her every day. If you don't bath, watch her hair every day. Within two days, all her scalp will be full of uh, boys. 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 Yeah. So ah. even here. This she, one is too much for one person. No? She has a wound. She has one because of this. I removed the thing that control her head because she's still she wear body suit and the all her legs is a wound right from hospital before we left. Okay. For you know what will happen? Day. Push her to the corner. Let me pray for you first. Okay. I see your only child or you have others. No, I have two boys. Okay. But you have suffered two taking care of this one. Yeah. Put it take the picture from her. Yeah, open your eyes. Relax, put your hand down. Take a deep breath. Mm, okay, do you stand there? That's it. Not you. Open it again. Open it again. One more time. Now close your eyes, close your mouth. Relax. A little file over your body. Don't say anything. Fire from your head to your toe. Fire. You spirit that is tormenting this woman and her family. It's time for you to go fire, more fire, fire, fire. Let's the keyboard this fire. Come out of her. I said, don't say anything. She doesn't watch my videos. So she doesn't know. She just came today for the first time, right? Yeah, but she is following the Okay. Fire. Thank you, Jesus. 
I declare you free in the name of Jesus. Amen. Bring the child. I can do this, right? Yeah. It was fire. Fire. So she doesn't even speak, right? She never sits for one day. I mean, speak. Yeah, she can't speak. All her body, and uh, she's only 21 kilos. It's okay. That is one. Fire. Fire. You demon. Let us put this girl in this condition. It's time for you to go. Out of her. The name of Jesus. Come out! Is she just saying no? That's what she normally says. It is well, hold the mic. More fire. Fire all over your body. It's time for you to leave her alone. I want you to be healed from your head to your toe. And you'll fix her bones, fix her legs, fix everything. Her brain, everything. Out! In the name of Jesus, I declare you free. And healed in Jesus' name. Amen. Somebody clap for Jesus. I pray for her and let God do the rest. She's free in Jesus' name. Next person, you in white. Hmm. Is it for the whole family or just you? Give her the mic. What's wrong with the daughter? Uh, my hair doesn't grow. Your hair doesn't grow? At the back. Since I was born. Let me see. Show me the back. You say your hair doesn't grow on the back. Yeah. When did this start? Since she was born. Wait. Are you seeing it? Show it. I see hair now. It doesn't grow. The front is grow longer. This is all the back. That's it. Seven the front grow, but the back never grow. So she started having hair. Yeah. And that's it. And she has a sinusis. Her nose is blocked. And all the time. And at times she gets up and marks. Marks all over her body. Come on, sweetie. How do you feel? Put your hand. What is your hand? You want your hair to start to grow? Yeah. And the sinus, is it there now? No. Yeah, come closer. Come closer. Open your eyes. Open it. Turn your back. Somebody raise the hair for me. Raise the hair for me. Yeah, close it. Put it back. Now face me. Put your hand down. Take a deep breath. Put your hand down. Close your eyes. Holy Ghost fire all over your body. I command your hair to begin to grow. In the name of Jesus. And that sign us I wanted to clear right now. In the name of Jesus. Out of her! Every witchcraft attack, I destroy. I destroy all those witches coming to scratch you at night. Let them all die by fire in the name of Jesus. I declare you free. I declare you healed. You will never have those things again in your body. And there will be no more sinus. And your hair in the back will begin to grow. And your destiny is restored. You are free in Jesus' name. Amen. You watch the videos. So when it starts to grow, you send the testimony, right? Go ahead, sweetie. You are free. And what's wrong with him? Block nose. Block nose. I've mind. seen so many block nose in this town. Is it the weather or something? And right now, his nose is blocked. It's blocked when he's like... Mm -hmm. And marks on his body. At times, yes, he gets up and Where are you from, scratches. sweetie? Where are you from? Um, my husband is from Delta. I'm from Cameroon. So why are witches scratching your kids? The only witch in the family. I don't know. Oh, yeah, come to me. Open your eyes. Open it. Close your eyes. 
fire all over your body. I command that spirit of sinus to leave you alone in the name of Jesus. Every witchcraft attack I destroy in the name of Jesus. I declare you free. I bring you out of that cage. No more sinus. No more marks. Your destiny is restored. You are free in Jesus' name. You come. You two, you don't have the mark or it's just the kids. You have sinus too. I'm just checking because I've heard so much sinus here. Open your eyes. You're their parents, so I'm praying for you. Close it now. Fire. Relax. Take a deep breath. Fire all over your body. Fire. 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 Out! In the name of Jesus. You are free. In Jesus' name. Somebody clap for Jesus. You will be glad to come. Valentina, be. What's wrong with you, sweetie? The devil has protracted high blood pressure. That's not unusual, no. I'm not supposed to have that. It's not for me. I know, but that's not the kind of sickness I call them for. He's been giving me consent because he's consuming my mommy, taking out of the his mommy. I pay for you every time I go to the chemist every month to pay to buy my drugs. And every time I give you the number for prescription, I have to pay another 50 euros. So, so it's, it's like a it's, you, it's a devour. Yes, yes, that's it. That's what you it pay is. your tight? Of course I do. No, because you, as we heard, devour, I'm going back to tighten and everything. So, no matter the medicine, you're still not getting better. No. So you believe it's not normal? It's not, it's not. Anybody in your family have it? That I know of. Uh, we ate probably, yeah, my elder brother. But well, his is not a asthma anyway. Okay, come on, sweetie. And you believe after this prayer, you won't need the medicine anymore? Right. Yeah. You say that's why I'm here. Hallelujah. Close your eyes. Fire all over your body. Fire on your chest, your heart, your back, everywhere. Thank you, Father. You spirit of high blood pressure. In fact, I use you as a point of contact to deliver every member in your family that has that issue. They will all be healed now. Out in the name of Jesus. You are healed. Your brother is healed. Anybody else in your family that has this is healed. You no longer need medicine. You are made whole. Whatever you have lost, God will restore. Your destiny is restored in Jesus' name. Do you believe what I said? You don't need the medicine anymore. All right? God bless you. The one in black comes with it. Black and black. Did anybody else join them after? Okay, good. Because I'm looking at it. Tell me what the sickness is. Uh, my period just stopped. How many months? Two years yes. now. For three years, you've not been bleeding. Two years. Two years? Yeah. You don't see your period? No. Hey. I went to hospital. Doctor told me he did every... He just checked on, check on me. He did everything. Now he, he just asked me if we have um, like a... Uh, uh, early... It's okay. I know what that thing is. How old are you? I'm 39. It's spiritual. Are you married? Yeah. Okay. I have three kids. Three but boys. for three years you've not seen your period. No. Come yeah, on, sweetie. When I came here, I think it's the weather. I'm here now. It's four years now. So since you came here, you've not seen it. Yeah. And you were thinking it was the weather that caused it. Yeah. Ah, I didn't know whether I felt period. <laughs> it's okay, sweetie. I know. You were just trying to think of something possible that would have made it stop, right? Yeah, yeah. But it's not the weather. A lot of women here live here now. They see their period. Come closer. As I'm praying for her, any woman, even those online. Those here that are experiencing something like this, if you tap into this prayer, you will be free in Jesus' name. And what else? You have back pain. Oh my back. Your back when hurts. When I start, yeah, just hurt me very bad. So right now you feel pain. Yeah. 
You can do bend, let's see. You can bend. Yeah, I can bend. When I just uh, just stand long, long time, it just happens. It just starts to hurt yeah. you. Yeah. Yeah, come on. So when do you want to see a period? Uh, contact for all my family. When do you want to see a period? When do you want it to come up? If it can come today. I'm no, ready. you're not ready now. You're in a program. <laughs> 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 okay, no problem. So you want to see today when you go home? Yeah. All right. And you have faith that when I pray, it will work? I have faith. I came from far away, Elis. Where is Elite? How many minutes or hours? Elis. Elis. Three. Three. Eh? Three. Three. Three hours? Yeah. You drove? Yeah. Wow. No, I'm not. I don't have car. Okay. I just take a bus. It is well. Oh, yeah. Open your eyes. Open it again. It's a spiritual husband. Close it now. Stay still. Close your mouth. Don't say anything. Fire all over your body. Fire on your back. Fire on your stomach. Your spirit. It's time for you to let this one go. Pack the sickness. I want her to see a period tonight. And it will start to come out regularly. In the name of Jesus. Even the back pain. I want it gone. Fire. 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 Fire, more fire, more, 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 more. Out of her! In the name of Jesus! Come out! Leave her alone! Everything you've taken from her, give it back. Everything you put in her, remove it now. Out! I want total healing. And I want her to come back with testimony tomorrow that it came out today. And I don't want her to feel pain anymore when she stands long. And I don't want you to visit her ever again. Now on the count of three, Angel, get that sword ready. One, two, three. Out! Chop it off. In Jesus' name. You are healed. No more pain. And your period will flow tonight. In Jesus' name. Do you believe what I just told you? Thank you, Jesus. So you will come tomorrow and testify. Thank you, Jesus. You believe, right? Yeah, thank you. Because I saw you in my dream. You saw me in your praying for you. No, you just lift me up. Wow, me like this. Yeah, you lift me up. I cannot even lift myself up. The, the second dream. It, has, it was an angel that appeared to you. The second dream, I saw I saw uh, uh, Pastor Isaac. Isaac. He just delivered my brother. Okay. As you have seen it, God has used me to set you free. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. You are free. Thank you, Lord. It was a spiritual husband. The woman with the, is that red hair being covered? Pink hair. Come on, today. Is that for you or for your child? Yeah. For you and your child. What's wrong? Give her the mic. Um, <clears throat> last year, she was diagnosed of scoliosis. She I've heard that thing before. What is scoliosis? What is it? The back. Her spinal cord is it's not straight. Yeah. And it's causing her pain at the back. Okay. And how about you? What's wrong with you? And, um, people keep on dying in, a, in our Your family. family. Where are you from? I'm from Cameroon. Okay. My mother died in 2017. Then my father died in 2018. One year later. Wow. And my junior brother died in December 2018 as well. Wow. So it's like one, one person dying. Yes. Okay, and she has the back thing. Yes. You, you are fine, just the spirit of death in your family. Yes, and I have a pain, a constant pain. In your back? Yes. Okay. Let me pray for her first. Come on, sweetie. So right now she's in so much pain. Yes. How old are you? 14. You're 14? And she's had this since she was born? She, just she was just diagnosed with it last year. Last year? So she was fine all the way? It just started last year. Yes. Wow. Sorry, sweetie. Open your eyes. Open it again. Close it. Close your eyes. Relax. Angel, I want you to fix her spine. I want that thing gone. You spirit of scolio scoliosis. Is that you guys pronounce it? Come out of her. The name of Jesus. Fix her spine. Fix it, straighten it, take that thing away. I don't want her to have any more pain. I don't want her to suffer anymore. 
fire, fire, fire on that spine, fire, fire all over your body, fire, fire, fix it, yes Lord, Raski Tadaboski in your hands, Kinelebosia. Out! In the name of Jesus, I declare you free and healed in the name of Jesus. No more scoliosis in Jesus' name. Raise up your two hands. Look around. How do you feel? Somebody clap for Jesus. You are healed. Next time you go to the doctor, a spine is straight. Amen. In Jesus Amen. Name. Do you believe what I said? Yes, I believe. And you will send the testimony. You watch the videos? Yes. It is well with you. Go sit down, man. You come. And you say you have a back pain that is hurting you? Yes. It's hurting me right now? Yes. Seriously? And the spirit of death? No, 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 no. Release your hand. I don't want to see your back, sorry. Face me now. <laughs> Come closer, sorry. If I look your back, I won't see the pain now. <laughs> I'll be eyes. Open it again. Open it again. One more time. Again. Now close it. Relax. Take a deep breath. Holy Ghost, fire all over your body. Mm -hmm. You spirit of death. Tormenting this woman and her family. You killed her mother, her father, her brother. I'm sure you're planning to kill somebody else. I break that curse right now in your family in the name of Jesus. Don't say anything. No more spirit of death. What is happening to you? Something's shaking you. You are the mic. What's happening? Your body is shaking. Mm -hmm. They were also planning to kill you too. Move it. That curse is broken. Nobody will die before their time. People in your family will live long. In the name of Jesus, more fire now. That pain in the back, you spirit of pain, come out. Come out, come out, come out, come out, come out, come out. Come out of her. Remove that pain. When I'm done, I don't want her to feel it ever again. She will be healed permanently. Out of her. In the name of Jesus. Are you using as a point of contact to free every member of your family? In the name of Jesus. You will not hear about anybody dying again anytime soon. In Jesus' name. Now on the count of three, chop off the head of that spirit. One, two, three. Come out! In the name of Jesus. Be healed in your back and all over your body. And your destiny restored. In Jesus' name. Somebody clap for Jesus. <laughs> Give her the mic. You were, you were shaking. It wasn't you that was doing it. Something was just shaking in you. Yeah. Shake your back. Do something you couldn't do. Check it very well. <laughs> no check. Look for the pain. Don't try to make me happy. Oh. That thing that was shaking. You say what? I can't feel the pain. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Is somebody clapping for Jesus? So that pain that has been there for how long now? It's gone. I can't feel it. For how many years did you have it? Two years. And right now? It's not there any longer. Check it very well. I'm checking. Pastor Isaac, I'm doing my cousin, Pastor Isaac, wait, check it. The, check, the pain that you were trying to show me is gone. Yes, it's gone. Bend and see. You still don't feel it? Nothing, no sign of it. Somebody clap for Jesus. You are healed in the name of Jesus. This man in the black trouser, come. What, what's that sickness? Oh, that's your husband. Uh-oh, somebody clap for the husband. He came out. Are you serious? He must really believe in the program that he actually came out. I am so happy to see you, sir. Go ahead, tell us what's wrong, sir. I've got severe back pain for the past four years. In your back? Yeah, my back pain. Spine? Spine, yeah. And there are times when I can't even walk or work with it. Hey, I feel the doctors, they try everything, but they can't find It's not, not the nothing there. So you believe that when you come out here and I pray, you'll be healed? Yes. But your wife is the one that watches me now. <laughs> Look at your wife, smiling. Look at your wife. She's smiling seriously. <laughs> Did you tell him to come out or he came out on his own? 
Wow, and you've been standing there since believing, watching people get healed. It is well. I'm sure something told you to come, come. And you just had it from, from nowhere. Okay. For four years. Four years. And you're ready for it to go. It's better to give somebody the glass so we don't know what happened. Are you feeling nervous or anything? Yeah. Something is shaking, beating. See, I like when men tell the truth. Come on, Sweeney. Open your eyes, sir. One more time. I'm trying to get that spirit of pain out. Open it again. Close it. When it goes fire all over your body, fire on that back, that spine. You spirit of pain, tormenting this man for four years. It's time for you to leave him alone. Fire, fire on your spine, fire. I want him to be healed instantly. I want an angel now to begin to massage the back quickly. Do it. Fix it. Fix it. Fix it. Fix it. Out! In the name of Jesus. Take your pain and leave. How's it doing financially? Struggling? I hear that something is holding you. I see like a bag of money being held. You didn't tell me that, but I, I wanted to ask your wife first. Don't don't talk to me. Let her talk. He said I'm struggling. <laughs> now release his finances. Close your eyes. Release his finances in the name of Jesus. When I finish praying for you, you begin to get phone calls that will change your life. Things will begin to work out for you. You are healed in your back. You are free. In the name of Jesus. And your destiny is restored. Your finances are restored. Jesus name. Are you able to jump? Is that all you can do for jumping? Yeah, man, man, jump. I don't know. I just heard that she tell you to jump. How do you feel? Give him the mic. Give him the mic. The pain is gone. Are you hearing? Look at his wife jumping. This man said the pain is... This is the man that his wife watches. Belema, Belema. Check it very well, please. The pain you've had for four years. It's gone. Somebody clap for Jesus. All our people are seeing it. For those of you that don't allow your women to watch. Now you see. He, he wasn't stopping her though. You are healed. And I saw a bag of money that was being held. It's released. The finances are restored. You will testify. I heard you will be getting calls that will change your life. Phone calls. I don't know what that is. Maybe contract. I don't know what it is, but I heard you will get calls and your life will change. You are free. And when it starts to change, maybe you will watch the videos more than your wife said. <laughs> Praise the Lord. Come on, sorry, you, the big one. Sorry, I don't, I didn't mean to say you're big. I'm big too. It's okay, good. Because some people don't get offended by that. Tell me, what's that thing that's wrong with you? So we only have four people, hallelujah. Because we only have one hour left. I've got spinal decompression. And then I'll pray mass prayer for everybody, okay? By yeah. tomorrow, a lot of you are coming back here with testimonies. Who believe that? Yeah. So many of you. Mm. You say you got spinal what? Decompression. What does that mean? That means I fractured my spine from the neck down the back. So there's pain right now in your back? Yes, I can't bend down. You can't bend? No, not too low. But you can bend a little bit. Yeah. Bend a little bit, let's see. And that's it? Yeah. And this has been out there for how long? Nine years. Nine years of spinal decom decompression. decompression. Yeah. And what else is wrong with you, Sweetie? That's it. There's pain in my knee. There's pain in your knee? Yeah. Which one? The left, the left knee? knee yeah. You can't kneel down? No. You can't bend, you can't kneel? No. It is what? What else? That's it. Spinal, spinal, spinal. Come, sweetie. How do you feel right now? Your heart is beating fast. Boom, 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 boom. Come closer. Open your eyes. Open it. Open it again. Close it. Relax. Take a deep breath. Fire all over your body. Fire on your back, your spine. Fire on your knees. Fire. 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 Uh-huh. Look at the hand shaking. Are you the one shaking the hand? Hey, fire. Look at that hand shaking. She says she's not the one. You snake in that hand. 
Fire. Fire. Fire all over your body. Fire on your spine. Fire on your knee. Fire everywhere. It's time for you to leave this woman alone. Even she will lose weight. After this prayer, I hear that you will begin to lose weight. Miraculously, that demon is responsible for this. Making you gain weight. Out! In the name of Jesus. Uh huh. Fire. Give her the mic. What is happening to you? I see your hand shaking. What's happening? So you're not the one shaking me. Mm. Alright, good. Angel. Chop off the head of all these demons in the hand. Fix her knee for her. I don't want any pain. And that spinal decompression or decon. Mm -hmm. Fix it. I don't want to hear the name of that thing no more. Fix it now. I don't want her to have pain. I want her to be able to bend for long and let her lose weight supernaturally. And everything else that that demon has held from her, I command it to be restored. Come out, 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 come out. Yes, leave her alone. Remove everything you put in her. Look at that. It's removing the face. Are you seeing that? Remove. Hey, yeah, remove, 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 remove. Remove the knee pain too. Remove the back um, thing, the pain, uh, the spinal thing on the back. That's right. Remove it. Remove it. Now restore back her destiny. Give her everything you stole. Uh -huh. You see that? Give her. Give her. Give her. Remove yourself from her house to clean her house. Uh -huh. Everything that you put in her house, remove it. Even the ones waiting outside to follow her, send them to hell where they belong. Any demon outside waiting for any of you to come back in you, fire back to hell where they belong. The name of Jesus. In her face, there's something you put. You can't leave now. I'm not done. Remove that thing on her face. Uh -huh. It's a mask. Uh -huh. You made her gain weight. I heard that. Remove the weight. Remove the weight from her. Remove the weight from her. So she will lose weight, right? We should lose weight. Eh? We should lose weight. After this deliverance. Come close to me. Bring her close to me. Good. As the spider pain gone. Hey. Hold up. Is the spinal pain gone? Is the knee pain gone? Come here. Now on the count of three. Angel, get the sword ready. Have you removed everything? Eh? Don't let her go there. Have you removed everything? Yes. Uh-huh. And who are you, this demon? Who are you? Eh? Who are you tormenting this woman? What have you done to her? You wicked evil spirit. Come here. Come close to me. My angel will chop off your head. One, two, leave her alone. Get that sword ready. Three, chop it off. Leave her. Leave her. Out. Leave her. In the name of Jesus, let them fall. Be free in Jesus' name. Amen. Come on, clap for Jesus. Get up, sweetie. Give her the mic. I'm sorry. Oh, oh, she's so weak. Somebody, where the ushers? Hold her before she fall. You're so weak. What happened to you? What were you doing on the floor? I'm sorry. Why are you sorry? Don't be sorry. Do you know what happened to you? Yeah. You're weak. Like something big left you. Yeah. Check your knee. Your, the knee pain is gone. Kneel down. Aha. Uh -huh. Wow. Are you guys seeing that? She couldn't kneel before. How is your back? Check it, check it, check it. Bend down. You say you can't bend for long. Stay there. Wow. You don't feel anything. Hey. Hey. Is somebody clapping for Jesus? Wow. So you haven't done this in a long time. You haven't been able to do this. I used to work for stroke patients. I had to leave the job because I cannot do moving. Anna. You cannot move, and now you can do everything. What What else could you not do before? I couldn't wear my bra. You say what? You say what? You couldn't wear your bra. Yeah. So how do you normally do it? Okay, put your hand in your back. Let's see if your hand can reach there. What about the other hand? So your two hands can reach your back. Somebody clap for Jesus. You are free. In the name of Jesus. God bless you, sweetie. Alright, let's get our offering.
I will pray for this for this get your offering. Even those online, we have only one hour left, so that those that want to leave early can be able to put their offering. Are you seeing how people are getting healed? Make sure tomorrow you come and get ready for testimony. We have four more people here. Quickly, you will get your offering. People are suffering here. When I finish for the four, we'll do a mass deliverance prayer for everybody. And tomorrow, I will just be seeing testimonies upon testimonies. Hallelujah. All right. If you have it, get up. Raise it up. Let me bless it real quick. Osha, do we have anything for offering? You will just pass it. They don't have to come out because I still need to. We have one more. I told you guys now. We, we finish quick. Before you know, it's 12 hours. Like now, we only have one hour. Can you believe it? And tomorrow, I see a lot of people coming to give testimonies. Stand up, everybody. Stand up, stand up with your offering. If somebody is here that don't have offering, give them. Raise up your hand if you don't have offering. Let somebody give, even if it's one euro. Bless somebody that doesn't have. Raise up your hand if you don't have any. Some of you are giving on paper. That's fine. If you're online and you don't have offering, mention it so that somebody will give you. Enough is enough. Hallelujah. Alright, raise up the offering. Speak into it. What do you want God to do to, for, you, for you as you give this offering? Just speak into it. You are the one that knows how hard it is for you. Show them. That's fine. Open your mouth. Bless your offering. As I give this offering, Father, my finances will change. As I give this offering, I will have more to give. As I give this offering, I will be healed. As I give this offering, Things will happen. Speak into it. It's your money that you're given. In Jesus' name. Father Lord, bless their offering. Whatever they have asked for, as they give this offering, give it to them. In the name of Jesus. Even those that are watching online, whatever they have asked for, give it to them. Those that don't have, let this be the last day that they will not have money. Provide for them. Next time, they will be the ones giving people. In Jesus' name. You are blessed. Your offering is blessed. In Jesus' name. And ushers, just go around them. Just go once you once you put your offering, you can sit. The ushers will go through you. Now the four people, where are you? Come on, sweetie. This one, Mag, is this Magdalene or something? That's you. She came to Dallas one time, right? Wow. So this is your town. Wow. Where is the mic guy? Come on. I how did I recognize you? You came to America like two years ago. Yes, when I had the baby. Wow! So this is where you live? Yeah. I had no idea. Alright, come on. So what's the pain? What's that sickness, girl? For instance, I don't even know where to start. A lot of problems. Strange and, illness? Yeah. What is it? My, I, my elder sister is here for the past 12 years. They gave her paper. Um, Bishop prayed for her last time with his picture in dance. This is a strange illness, right? Yeah, mental health, yeah. For you or for somebody? For my sister. So nothing is wrong with you? Because we're praying for people here now. Not people that are not here. If not everybody knows one person that is not here. Isn't that so? Don't you have somebody that is sick somewhere? Absolutely. So this is for your sister? Yeah. Mental health. Yeah. But for you, you're okay? By his grace. By his grace, you're fine. Okay. I pray that God will deliver her from that sickness. Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. It is done. Thank you. In Jesus' name. God bless you. Because I was looking at you. Ah, there were four now. One more person added. That woman was not there before. Were you there before? You were not there with them. Okay. You, come with the white and this thing. No, 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 the other one. Come, sweetie. You say what? God bless you, sweetie. What's wrong with you? I have regret. I don't sleep in the night. You have what? I, mean, I don't have no sleep in the night. You don't I, sleep at night? No. Okay. I see dead people every night. You see dead people at night? Yeah. I talk to dead people, people that are dead in my family. I always talk to them in the night. Since, since seven months now, I've not been feeling fine. Even my hand has dried. I've your hand, what's wrong with your hand? I've tried. Look at my hand. I've you tried. scratch it. I tried it. No. It's dried up. Yeah, it's dried up. Because I don't, when I try, I don't feel like getting up. Something or to take shower, and you and see dead people, yeah. And I feel weak, you're weak right now, yeah. I feel weak to get up in the morning, and you're not walking, no, not walking because of this sickness. Yes. 
Okay, come closer. God will help you. If you have faith, do you have faith? Do you watch the videos? I do. My friend introduced me to you. Who's your friend? Fatima. Fatima. God bless you, sweetie. Yeah, come closer. Put your hand down. Relax. Take a deep breath. Open your eyes. The switches that are attacking you. Open your eyes again. Open it again. Open it right now. Close it now. Don't think of anything. Just relax. Holy Ghost fire all over your body. Fire from your head to your toe. Fire. 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 You demon tormenting this woman. She can't sleep at night. It's time for you to leave her alone. And go. Out of her! In the name of Jesus. Today when she goes home, she will sleep well. Like a baby. She said her hand dried up. She's feeling weak. Receive strength in your body. Everything that you took away from her, I command it to be restored. Everything you put in her, I command it to be taken out now. In the name of Jesus. Out! In Jesus' name. And whoever is responsible for this, fire on you. Begin to confess now. Confess now. Confess now. Confess now. In Jesus' name. I declare you free and healed in the name of Jesus. When you come back tomorrow, you will testify because you are healed. You are free in Jesus' name. Somebody clap for Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. You are free. When you go home today, you will sleep well. Thank you, Jesus. And when you come tomorrow, you will testify Thank you. that you feel different. Thank you. It's just an evil spirit. Come on, sweetie. You. You deserve it. You deserve it. God bless you, sweetie. Amen. You watch the videos too? I start to watch you. It was uh, 10 or 11 of November 2018. That's not bad. God bless you. What's wrong with you? Uh, many, 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 now many years, many prophets have told me that, prophet told me that I have a snake in my body. And then, Prophets told you you have snake in your body. When I was going to the churches, and then he moved. Since I watched you, he moved a lot. He, in the back, and then he, in the womb, and then I can feel it. And then I, and now I dream a lot. Of so there is, there is a snake in your body now moving. Uh -huh. when As you are standing here now. Till I can it's moved. From where? Yeah. The side. Uh -huh. it's inside my... Face the camera a little bit. Let her see you. No, no, no. This way, sweetie. I want her to see you. Oh. Come closer. You guys are not doing it. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. So you, you feel movement on this side. Mm -hmm. Okay. So this movement is here now as you're standing here. Yeah. And then the back pain as well. And then and the, the prophets, they told you you have snake in your body. Yeah, in many churches. And they said that this is why I can't have a baby because... It, you don't have child. One but you've been trying to. After that but how come the prophets they did not remove the snake now? I think it was. Uh, I tried to go to the church in 2005, six, seven, eight. They told me, you know, and then they said that this is I cannot have another child because a, a, a snake ate a, all eight. Okay, but my thing is, they prophesied to you. So why did they not remove the snake? Uh, they don't. Did they try to remove it? But the snake was too strong. You know, they call you, they prophesy, and then go back to sleep. Okay, so you used to go to where there were so many prophets, but they don't pray for you. No, I mean, I did the deliverance. Oh, you did the deliverance. Hey, that's what I'm waiting to yeah, hear. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A general deliverance that they do. I, I run many ways to, to be here. You but went to was, many places. Oh, yes, because. But the yes. snake is still there. Oh, yes. Is it that you don't have faith? <laughs> I'm just saying because if people have tried to deliver you, pray for you, it's not living. Sometimes people make it seem like it's the pastors, but it's actually the person. Yeah, come, stand here. So right now the snake is moving. And you have pain in your back. You say, what do you do here? The snake brought you here. Because you are tired of this snake. Yes. How many years have you been having this? Long time 
because my children have a 24 years, I didn't have a genetic. Since you're okay, you're married. I was married, no, but I'm not no, married. okay, I'm a it is well. Relax, open your eyes, open it again. Holy Ghost, fire all over your body, fire, you snake, tormenting this woman, fire. Uh -huh. What's happening to you? Eh? What's happening? What's happening? Eh? Speak to me. What is happening? Is that the snake? Okay, it's time for you to go this snake. She said 20 something years. Pain and snake. Oh yeah, remove yourself from her body. Take yourself away. Come out of her. Come out. I don't want her to have any pain again. And I don't want you in her body again. She says she's been to many prophets, many places. You are not more powerful than God. It's time for you to get out of this body. Angels, kick out this snake. Rakata, Yapakas, Kenya. Fire, fire, more fire. More, more, more. On the count of three, chop off the head of this snake. Send it to hell where it belongs. One, two, three, out! In the name of Jesus. Come out! In Jesus' name. Be free. In Jesus' name. From today, you will never feel that snake again. And that pain is gone. You are free. In Jesus' name. Somebody clap for Jesus' name. Get up, sweetie. What happened to you? Do you know what was happening? You were shaking and... What was doing that thing? Was that you? Huh? You don't know? You were shaking and then you fell. Who pushed you down? Check your... Um, I said check your snake. Sorry, it's not your snake. Because. Check your side. Is the snake still there? The pain, everything checked. Give her. You say what? I don't feel pain. She said, I don't feel pain. Is somebody clapping? How about the snake movement? Check it. Look for it. The thing that all the prophets told you about. Check very well, though. Okay. This is pure exercise. Tell her. What is it? She said, I don't feel the movement. I don't feel the pain. Instantly, she is free. After 20 something years, is somebody clapping for Jesus? You are free in the name of Jesus. Eh? Oh, you paid for her ticket to come. Oh, you invited her here. Hallelujah. Through him. Oh. He said they block your finances. That's why he paid for you. But you are free and you are restored. You will come back tomorrow and testify because you will never feel that movement again. In Jesus' name. Go and sit down. Come you. And then the lady and the kids will be last. Come on. I didn't see you before, but you say you came out. So you went to go. No problems with it. All right. What is that thing that's wrong with you? I opened your video of uh, blessing water, bless the water. Wait, come face like this. Make them face my camera lady. Is it better now? All right, good. I opened your video of blessing water, I bless the water. I shall drink the water. I start, and my tummy start to shake, shake, shake. And I feel that maybe there's something, maybe there's moving the object in me. Why do I want to be free from that? And I always have a headache concerning the Headache? You have it now? Yeah, I have it now. Is this braided or weak? It's a weak. Because the way the hair is tight, I was like, this thing can cause headache too, but it's a weak. Yeah, it's... I have a headache since, since 10 years. I have a headache. Okay, One sorry. I, no, this is not braid. This is weak. Yes. Okay, good. That's your wife. I was going to say your wife braid is too tight, but thank God it's a weak. She has a party B as well. She has what? Hepatitis B. Okay. So this is your husband. Yes, we have the spirit of death in our family. You have spirit of death. In our family, yeah. 
It is well. A lot of witches. A lot of witches. Yeah. She has a brother, the mom, and the parallel sister. She's a witch, you know. Your sister is a wheelchair. Yeah. Your brother and your mom there. Yeah, so, but wait, you see, it was after you drank my water that your belly started to shake. Yeah. So the water was not good for you. <laughs> I don't know. I think the water, I don't feel it starting to shake, shake. I don't know. So before the water, there was no shake, shake. No, no, no. no. Hey, this water, oh. <laughs> People normally drink the water and get healed. Your own is called shaking. Yeah, you were just yeah, making a decision. Like something is there. Yeah. I see that and that thing is me. Is it shaking now? No, it's not shaking now. Okay, so it shook that time. Yeah, that time. Yeah. What and is it shaking happened? again? Since that time? No, no, no. <laughs> Every time they use it 39 minutes. Every time we play the video, it's something shakes. So there's a demon there. Every time you want to play that. That's what she's supposed to say. But when she say I drank water and shake. It looks like my water make a shake. Because my water is anointed. Yeah. So every time there's deliverance, something shakes in your stomach. Yeah. And then people are dying in your family. Yeah. And hepatitis, hepatitis B. Yeah. And constant headache. Yeah. Only you. Your wife is going through a lot too. And it's what comes with it. You believe that when I pray for you today, you'll be free? And release your hand. Come closer. Just take a deep breath. Relax. Hey, open your eyes. It goes fire all over your body. Fire from your head to your toe. Fire. Close it now. Fire. Uh-huh. You evil spirit. You demon. That is shaking in her belly. Causing this woman to be uncomfortable. Killing people in the family. It's enough. Enough is enough. Fire. 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 Rakata. Breakout. Koto. Brain there. More fire. More fire. More fire. Close your eyes. I cancel the spirit of death in your family. In the name of Jesus. And I send an angel to heal your sister that is on wheelchair. In the name of Jesus. Don't say anything. Just fire. 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 Even in your belly. That thing that is shaking. I want you to shake now and shake out. Shake now. Shake out of her. Come out of her. In the name of Jesus. That hepatitis B. I need healing now. That constant headache be gone. More, more, fire, fire, fire. Out! Out! In the name of Jesus. More. Nobody will die before their time. People will live long in your family. The curse is broken. And you, Raprekesh Kotorupanya, every witch. Wizard, tormenting your family, fire on them. I want them to die. In the name of Jesus. On the count of three, get the sword ready. One, two, three. Chop it off. Be free. In Jesus' name. No more hepatitis B. No more headache. No more movement in your stomach. Your sister is healed. No more spirit of death. In Jesus' name. Clap for Jesus, somebody. What were you feeling when I was praying for you? Something was happening to you. Exactly. Yeah. You were shaking. Yeah. But how do you feel now? I'm feeling no, I'm okay. Before I came to you, I was shaking. Before you came, you were shaking. I was shaking, yeah. But now you are calm. Yeah. You are free. Yeah. In Jesus' name. Come on, sweetie. With the boys. After this, I pray for everybody and we go. We have one more day. Tomorrow I'm gonna give all of you the long dresses, the ladies. And the guys will see if we'll have some shirts for them. Go ahead, sweetie. What's wrong? I, I believe something. Um, my problem is not natural. All these boys that I'm holding, they couldn't talk. All the boys? This All of them. And the, and the other How many children you got? Three. three. Yes. They couldn't talk. Your... They couldn't talk. They can't talk. Your three sons don't talk? Yes, they don't. Ah. They don't. How old are they? This one is six. Six years old? Three, three years and some months. Are they twins? They have never spoken. Um, occasionally, mama, <coughs> mama, and other seeds. When it talks, it doesn't say it anymore. Where are you from, sorry? From Nigeria. What part? Sorry? What part of Nigeria? Ocean State. You say you believe it's not normal? It's not normal. When he was a baby, I had a dream that he was walking. Who? Oh. He was walking, uh huh. Walking. The 
then I said, ah, maybe he will, be, he will do his thing fast. And that's it. And I, I will have a dream that he had poo on his body in a, in a dream. Same to all of them. I will dream that you will dream they have poo? Yeah. yeah. All right. And, and Leave them. Let the ushers hold them. Come, let me pray for you first. They yeah, are coming down. Come, you come in down. Okay, it's calm now. How are you feeling right now? You're shaking. Come close to me. How can you have three children and nobody talks? Nobody. It's not normal. No. And you watch the videos. I watch. My friend always shares Fatima. You. Yeah. Where is Fatima? Where is she? God bless you. You are always inviting people along. This is Fatima. God bless you, sweetie. Yeah, put your hand down. Open your eyes. Open it again. Open it again. Again. Close it. Relax. Holy Ghost fire. All over your body. Fire from your head to your toe. You demon that has caused her children not to speak. That is tormenting this woman. It's time for you to leave her alone. Fire. 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 Come out of her. In the name of Jesus. Leave this family alone. Fire. Fire. More fire. More fire. What is happening to you? What's pushing you back? Something pulled you back. Don't come for that. Fire. It's a spirit that is living. More fire. More. 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 Now lose their tongues. I want her children to begin to speak. <laughs> fire. Fire. Wherever you cater her, that kids. Free her now. Out. Leave her alone. Come out. Come out. Wrap up on your coat while you're on your heart. How can she have three children and no one is speaking? More fire. Push her close to me. Bring her close. That place that you, you put that pit. I dig every one of them out of there. Fire. More. 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 Come out. In the name of Jesus. Fire in her house too. Go through the house. Cleanse the house. Cleanse it. Out of her. Sometimes you will leave them alone. Leave her alone. Let her fall. Leave her alone. Leave her alone. Fire. Uh -huh. Come here. There's a spirit that is tormenting you. I want to make you suffer. More. 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 More, 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 more fire. I want total cleansing in your body. Come up. Come up. In the name of Jesus. Bring that up. Anyone that is watching online that is going through the same thing or here. You have a child or family member that is not speaking. Be free in the name of Jesus. They are free in Jesus' name. What is happening to you? Give her the mic. What's happening to you? Mm -hmm. That thing will leave now. Fire. Just relax. Relax. Don't fight it. Fire. Fire. All those witches that have gathered together to torment you. I send fire to them. They will all confess and die in the name of Jesus. Your children, all three of them will speak. They will be normal and you will give this testimony. And the world will celebrate Jesus. Now on the count of three. What's happening? Eh? Eh? Let it, let it move. Let it. Something's moving your head. Leave it. Don't worry. Fire. Fire. They've killed you and your children. That's why. Fire, fire, fire. Uh -huh. Leave her, leave her. Fire. She's not the one doing it too. That's enough. You've done too much to this woman. How can she have three boys and nobody speaks? Pick her up. More. More fire. More fire. More. More. Come here. Where are you going to? Who are you? Who are you? What have you done to this woman? Eh? What have you done to her? Leave her alone. Leave her. What have you done? 
Eh? Are you the one making her children not to speak? Is that you? Eh? Well, it's too bad. Angel, get that sword ready on the count of three. Leave her alone. You chop off the head of these demons. One, two, three. Out! Leave her. Chop it off! Out! In the name of Jesus. Be free. Leave her. In Jesus' name. Leave her, leave her. Come on, you clap for Jesus. Leave her, leave her. How do you feel? How are you feeling now? What was happening? Can you describe it? Something started pulling your head, pulling you backward, pulling you sideways. And you were not in control of it. No, I couldn't control it. Has that thing happened to you before? No. So you were shocked that it happened? Uh, I'm, I'm feeling happy. You're I feeling happy right now? That it happened because the suffering is too much. All right, bring the boys now. Let me bless them. You say you have three boys, right? Yeah. One died. You have four. Hi. Open your eyes for me. Come here. Open your eyes. You are free. Begin to speak in the name of Jesus. Open your eyes. You are free. Begin to speak in the name of Jesus. You are free. Begin to speak in the name of Jesus. Somebody clap for Jesus. They will all begin to speak. And you will come back and testify. In fact, by tomorrow, you will come here and testify. Is somebody clapping for Jesus? Hallelujah. Everybody get up. I want to pray a mass prayer for all of you. Not now. Who? Cool. Come. Testimony from today. Wow, she said she has testimony. What happens with it? Stand there and face. Before, my period came out when I was 15 years. As you said, I used to have terrible pain if you want to come out. So I'm, I'm expecting my period tomorrow. But when I went to the toilet now to eat myself, I found out my period was out. And there was no pain. Pain, no pain. Hey! After her deliverance. She got prayed for earlier. You guys remember her? Since you were 15 years old, yes. every time it happens, you must go through pain. Yes. Yes. The kind of pain that you take medicine. Yes. And now it just came out. Can somebody clap for Jesus? That means you are free. Everything else is gone. Thank you, Jesus. Go ahead and sit down. Wow. Are you guys seeing it? Tomorrow. How many of you still believe that? I need to chop something off for you to be free. It is well. This is a mass one. I want the people online to, put, to participate. I don't want any child to make noise. Just close your eyes, everybody. There was no child crying since. Now that I want to do this one. <laughs> That's how the one blocked is. Have you guys seen what happened? People are being healed, free, men, women, children. Wow. These people have suffered 13 years, 20 years. And it took just a few minutes and they are free because of Jesus. Just take one minute and pray and say, Father, thank you for what you have done. Father, free me too. I want to be free too. I want to come back here tomorrow with the testimony. You know, and what God has given me power to do, a lot of people don't do it. Some people go to churches and they need deliverance and they're not able to. What is that? What were you saying in the mic? Turn off. Holy Ghost fire. Pray, pray, pray. One minute. I have some deliverance angels ready to chop off some demons. Even those online, get up from your seats and pray. 
What is that thing that you need deliverance from? Even if it's for your child at home, your sister, your mother, your brother, call their name, pray. Because as you are tapping in for them, at this very time, something will be happening to them wherever they are. If you believe, that's right, you will not go back the same. Those online, I hope you are hearing me. Hey, if you have somebody, you that is watching online, that needs to be a part of this prayer, this is the time to invite them. You will forbid things, you will remove things from your body, you will be, chains will be broken from your body. You saw how God has been healing people here. Setting people free. Distance. There's no distance in the realm of the spirit. He knows your heart. God searches the heart. He knows those who truly believe. Some of them have been in so many places. Look at the one with snake. She's been everywhere. The snake is still there. But today it's God. No more movement. There's power here for this. from your heart. Enough is enough. This is your last bus stop. Even your finances, some of you, they have tied up your finances. Money is a problem. A witch is sitting on it. You heard what that girl said. The grandmother will be sick. She will send money. Not knowing the grandmother is the reason for their problems. Anyone you have sent money to that has paid your money, that has done something to what you sent them, you want to be free from them. That's right. Pray from your heart. You have suffered a lot in this country. Whichever country you are in. And God says, enough. God did not create you to come and suffer. Every pain in your body, pray. That after this prayer, the pain will be gone. You that is having memory loss, pray. You that is struggling in ministry, pray. You that your children are all sick, pray. Your children are stubborn, they don't listen to you, pray. People back home are always sick, asking for money, pray. Your business is not moving, your job, everybody hates you. Stagnation, backwardness. Every time you dream, you see yourself back, backward in your village. In the place that you have left six. You that cannot get married, no one wants to marry you. Pray. You that is married, your marriage, quarrel, quarrel, fight, fight, fight. You are not enjoying your marriage. Pray. Husband is always sick, wife is always sick. Pray. You that know that you're supposed to be at a different position, different level. Or promoted in your job, but they have refused to promote you. I say, pray. You that is like there's a hole in your pocket. Money keeps disappearing from your hand. You don't even know how. Pray. You that have a neighbor that is sick, pray for that neighbor. You that have that condition that you are ashamed to tell somebody about it. Maybe you have a sickness that you are ashamed to come out for today. Pray. God will locate you. I see 146 angels. I see them holding a sword. About to chop off heads of things. Pray for this country too. Pray for this land. Break every cause in this land. Everything that is causing people from, from succeeding. People cannot succeed in this land. Break it. Pray. Every evil that has been done on this land. Pray, Those watching online, get your children around you too. That's right, I see you pray. Because you are tired. Enough is enough. You have to be free. Liberation. Pray that witch that puts you in that condition. Let her die. 
let him die. Confess and die. They say you will not succeed over their dead body. Okay, fine. And then they will die. They tied your children. They tied your family. One witch is tormenting the whole family. Can you believe this? One witch. Hey! Every food they put in you, even food they feed you in your night, in the night when you're sleeping. They be feeding you with food and drinks in your sleep. Command it to melt away from your system. Evil food, evil deposit. Every charm they put in your house, on your village, in your car. Some of you have charms in your house, you don't even know. A friend came there. Not me, he said, somebody gave her a dress to wear, her dress. And before you know it, it's like they sprinkle salt on her dress. Anyone that has put something on your clothes, or on something that belongs to you, fire. In Jesus' name. Now I want to pray. Keep all this. Stop. Children, stop. Everywhere. Quiet. Raise up your two hands. Focus. No noise. Close your eyes. Don't look around. You have to believe God is here. He sent me here for you. Holy Ghost fire all over your body. Fire. Angels. Pour buckets of fire on them. Make their body hot and uncomfortable. Fire. 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 From the back to the front to the middle. Fire. Even online. Fire. 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 Out of them. In the name of Jesus, you demon sitting on their destiny, fire on you, fire, you witch, you wizard, tormenting them, fire, 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 fire in your belly, fire, fire, fire in your back, fire, 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 fire. Ushers, be part of this prayer. I don't want you holding anybody, let them fall if they have to. More fire, more fire, more fire, more fire. Come out in the name of Jesus, out of them. sickness in your body, I command it to melt away. Out, 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 out. In the name of Jesus, whatever you have eaten or drank that is evil, poison, charm, come out of your system. Yo, bump, cough, vomit, sneeze, come out. Out, 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 out. In the name of Jesus. Now, everything they put on you that is evil, remove, 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 remove. Just leave it there. Mask on your face. Fire. 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 Remove that mask. Remove that chain. Remove that crown. Remove that ring. Remove that socks. Remove that thing that you saw that coming to. Remove, 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 remove. Leave it letter four. Leave it letter four. Fire. 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 Leave it letter four. Out. In the name of Jesus. More fire. I use you as a point of contact. To free your children, your husband, your wife, your family, here and back home. Fire, 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 fire. Come out in the name of Jesus. Whatever it is that brought you here, fire, 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 fire. Out in the name of Jesus. Every sickness, every disease, every evil spirit, every bad habit, every blockage. Fire, fire. In the name of Jesus, on the count of three, get that sword. One, two, three. Cut off the head of these demons. Cut it off. Now be free. In the name of Jesus, be healed, be restored. In Jesus' name. Somebody clap for Jesus. All right, let's get the choir. Choir, come and sing before we share the grace. I know that you guys thought I forgot about you. We still have 30 minutes. You need my mic. My mic works. You're going to stand here and face the audience, right? This is good now. You're not that many. Abi? Oh, well. Yeah, this mic is best. If you're going to use mic. Yeah, let's not use mic. Let's not 
not use mic. Put the mic down. Let's not use mic. I know what she's saying. Come on. Who is the lead singer? Yeah, come on, stand here, stand here, face the audience now. You can't face me, you're singing to the audience. Let me be behind you. Who is the lead singer? Nobody. Okay. Come on, you can block me. Go and join yourself. They only practice for like 30 minutes today, so let's see what they got. Keyboard can lower it now. You can hear them. Mm. 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 So I'll take picture of all of you one by one, okay? Because I may not do it tomorrow.
choir. Come on now. They just practice today like 20 minutes. Right before I think. They are coming from different parts of the world. They watch online. And they are just practicing for the first time. Clap again for them. It is not easy. Instead of them to say they are not ready, they say no, we have something. And they did good. Tomorrow, if you want to sing with them, just come early. Even those watching online that couldn't make it today. Come as early. They open here at 7. Don't try to come at 6. Maybe 6.45. 7 and by 8. One hour practice is enough for you and them, right? Okay, so come early. And if you want to join Usher to tomorrow, no problem. When I come, just let me know that you want to add to the Ushers. I, I'm make, we're going to be leaving in a few. We're here till 8. It's 7.44. So I want us to share the grace. So for those of you that have been wanting to take a picture with me, when we finish, you will stand. We've already taken offering. You will stand in a long line. Usher, you will help us. And they will quickly come. Take picture. Go. Take picture. Go. So you can have picture on your profile picture or on your page. Let's rise up and share the grace. Is this song I like to sing? We just want to sing slowly. Baba oh, We just want to say Baba oh, Sing it from your heart, somebody. I say we just want to say Baba oh, But for the ones that he has done today, just thank him. God said we should never take what he does for granted. Because if we do, he will stop doing. Thank you for deliverance, for healing, for salvation, for restoration, for the word. Thank you for everything, Father. Thank you for peace of mind. Some of you were weak when you came. You are strengthened. Some of you never knew you could do 12 hours. But look at it. You are here. Nothing happened. You are not. You did not die. You did not collapse. You are still strong. Hey! Thank you for that. Tomorrow you will still come here strong and healthy and ready to receive more. Oh, we just want to say. Lord, we thank you for today. Today is day one out of two days. And so far we saw how you freed a lot of people, healed people. People said, people repented. People got restored. People got freed from cages. Oh, not just the ones here. Even the ones that are online. Father, Lord, whatever they have received may be permanent in the name of Jesus. May the devil not snatch it from them. In the name of Jesus, that they go home, you go back, you go home with them safely and bring them back tomorrow safely. They will sleep well in the name of Jesus. Any evil arrow that is being shot at them as they, as they are going home, I send it back to send them in the name of Jesus. Any demon that is waiting for them out there or somewhere around their house, Holy Ghost fire, send them back to hell where they belong. In the name of Jesus, they are free in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. We love you so much. We appreciate you. We adore you. We don't take you for granted. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord, for making it possible. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name. Let's share the grace in fellowship. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the sweet fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us now forevermore. Amen. Surely, goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of our lives. We should run in the of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. Just stand where you are. Come, stand here. Take a picture. I want to face them. Do you see me and them? The crowd take. Wide. Okay. Just start from there. Just stand where you are. Wide. Everybody, form a line here. Get your phone if you need your phone selfie.
Please make it orderly so that once we finish, you go. Once we finish, you go. Because we have till 8 here. It's almost 8. Um, Ricky, um, Ricky, get the phone ready. Please tell them to pack up my mic and give me. It didn't really work, so I don't need it here. I don't know if she has a box. Alright, quickly, quickly. You're going to take picture now. Come stand here. Quickly, quickly, quickly. Sense press it. Get your phone ready. Quick, quick, quick. Open your phone now. Alright. Please make it ready for me. Is it nice? Let me see one first. Wow, very nice. All right, go straight. Go, go, go. Please have it ready. Don't come and do it ready in front of me. Bless you, come on, come on, come on, come on. Somebody has to use this phone and take it. Are you here? God bless you. Quick, quick, quick. We want to be out of here by eight. Those are so nice. All right, once you get your picture, you're free to go. God bless you. you okay. Okay. God will favor you in Jesus' name. Where's your phone? Come on. Nice. Come on, let's do quick. Oh, this is for me. Oh, thank you. So heavy. Wow. This looks like a lot of money, right? <laughs> okay, you guys are wasting time. No. you guys for watching. You know that after this one more tomorrow here and then London and then France and then Austria. Come on, 
God is the one that makes me take pictures of you guys. Come on, come on, come on. You're not ready, come on. Oh, Jesus. Be ready when you come. I don't have time. I'm tired already. I'm just trying to make you guys happy. Come on, sweetie. It's too late. Oh, thank you, darling. The woman of God from Will Fanet. God bless you, sweetie. Thank you. All right, please, when you take it, you can start living. God bless you, God bless you. Come on, come on, come on, let's do this quick, quick. Almost done, almost done. God 
bless you. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Promise something. Promise for me. Uh, okay, that's the other thing you told me. Okay. So that's for tomorrow. You sure you don't want to bring this one tomorrow so I won't forget? Yes. Come on, let's go. Bless you. Thank you. Bless you, sorry. Bless you. Is it better? 
you seen everybody? Everybody, yeah. Smile, everybody. Smile, please. Still wait. Okay. Okay, come on. There is a glass there. Alright. Oh, okay. Okay. I want somebody to take me and my two workers. Somebody hold that phone for me. Don't turn off the video. We love you guys. We'll see you tomorrow. God bless you for watching and sharing the world with you. All right, see you tomorrow. I'm still in Dublin, Ireland. If you missed it, check my profile picture so you can be here tomorrow from 8 to 8. God bless you. Bye bye.